It's just an alarm. It's just an alarm. It's just an alarm. I've had an epiphany. This isn't unanimous science. I have a working theory surrounding the concept of fear. More precisely, how we process fear. I wasn't quite done yet. Oh, my bad. According to Bill Nye. If somebody believes in astrology, mm -hmm. it takes them about two years to get over it. You have to show them over and over. Uh, this, there's no such thing as astrology. It right. doesn't really work. And then they let go. But I believe that fear, the emotional sense we have, is composed of three separate but powerful elements, all of which equally contribute to cementing our behavioral reactions, adjusting our behavior or reactions, and dictating our behavior or reactions. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Keep up. The three elements are the feeling itself, our response to the feeling, the confirmation or rejection of our response. Are you learning anything yet? Think about it. You have a feeling. I, I got, got a feeling. feeling. Ooh. Be it good or bad, right or wrong, you have a feeling. Let's start with that feeling. Here is an unpleasant emotional state consisting of a physiological and psychological response to a real threat or danger. Fear is an unpleasant emotional state. Psychology today defines fear as a vital response to a physical emotional danger. Fear is a response. The Collins Dictionary of Medicine defines fear as a response to a real or imagined perception of danger. I'm fear not finished! Fear. We'll go on. It goes on to say that a degree of fear or a fear inappropriate to its cause is called a phobia. Fear is accompanied by physical symptoms such as rapid heart rate, muscle tension, especially in the abdomen, dryness of the throat, and sweating. These symptoms are mainly caused by adrenaline. It's believed that the separate nuclei and the amygdala mediate different aspects of a fear condition behavior. You finished? Yes. Well, all right. Fear is a response to believed or perceived danger. No matter what dictionary you look into, it always refers to fear as an alarm. The feeling we get is just an alarm. Just like a siren, a bell, a horn, or even your phone. It's just an alarm. It's just an alarm. It's just an alarm. Fear is just an alarm. The alarm, the action, the confirmation, all composed behavior we associate with fear. Got it? Are you learning anything yet?